YouTube, welcome back to the channel, man. This is American Dilly, and today I'm jumping into some music news from the homeboy FJ Outlaw. Look, man, Mako Music is shooting movies. That's what they're doing. And you've seen the work they've been putting in with Savannah Dexter, so it ain't no doubt that all the other artists on their label get that treatment too. FJ Outlaw shooting a brand new music video. They put it out all over Instagram, all over the social media, Bavard County, Melbourne area, you know what I mean? Coco area. I got family down there, man. Gosh, I'm so, I'm, look, I'm beside myself because I'm not down there like I usually was before, you know, before I started moving around and doing my thing with the Navy, but it's okay. It's okay. I'm so excited to see the work that these guys are putting in. So anyway, without further ado, man, let's jump in to see some behind the scenes footage from FJ Outlaw, Mako Music. Here we go. A video shoot today. It's finna be lit. Holler at me for the details. Brevard County, Florida, we out here. You know what I'm saying? Get at me. Spitting, I ain't living, but saying I'm about to shit on everyone who ever doubted that win. Came out the trailer. <laughs> That first scene right there looks amazing. Looks amazing. Hold on. Let me pause this video real quick and give a shout out to Sip Shine. Drink of the summertime. If you haven't had it, get on over to SipMoonshine.com. Promo code SHINE10. And tell them Dilly sent you and get your sip. Get your sip because... Oh, strong. I love it. I can't lie. I love it. Anyway. Jumping back into the music news. That first setting looks amazing. It's like a nighttime setting in any way. We're gonna jump into some more videos and just see how the making of this video goes into effect. I'm the man, but I bet a hundred dollars I can whip your ass. Now when you see me, you all can hear the way I talk. It's obvious that I'm a product of the trailer park. There you go, man. We got all of Mako music in attendance. Savannah Dexter is on the set. Drake, Drake McGuire, Drake McGuire's on the set. Of course he's on the set. He's on the set with Ghost. Full Scope is on the set. That's what I love about Mako Music, man. Bravo Gitter brought these guys together and it is a team and it always looks like a team effort when something goes in. That's what I enjoy about it. I'm, I'm just saying, that's what I enjoy about it, man. That's what I enjoy about it. It's just insanity. Mako Music, everybody together is like a family. They're all doing this together. It seems like everybody likes to help out everybody with the projects, jumping on, doing things like this is the start of something amazing. And I'm not going to lie, since the beginning of my channel right here, when I did speak on the first time I saw Savannah Dexter, Mako Music has been showing me a lot of love. And because of that, I show the love back, man. It's called respect. A lot of people don't understand respect. But if you understood respect, you would understand that people who... Show respect, get respect. That's just how it goes. That's how it goes with Dilly. So, wow, what I'm saying is this video right here looks like it is about to be amazing. FJ Outlaw, it's about to be amazing. Bravo said it. Bravo said it. He's like, hey, if y'all want to get features from FJ Outlaw, you better jump on it while you can. Because after this, we taxing. And I believe he said that before the last video with Savannah Dexter came out. So I'm pretty sure they're taxing now. But I'm sure if you hit these guys up, man, you can still do work if you are an artist who is looking to come up. I mean, Bravo has said that. He looks for star quality in a musician, in a artist. You know what I mean? So if you got that star quality... Hey, man, don't hesitate. Show it off. Let them see it. You know what I'm saying? If you get the call back, tell them Dilly sent you. If you don't, well, hey, man, keep on striving. Because that's what Savannah Dexter was talking about in the interview when she was talking, like, advice for up-and-comers and stuff. Don't give up. Why would you give up? You know what I mean? A thousand no's shouldn't make you give up because you could get the one yes. You gotta keep striving. Keep striving, y'all. Let's look at more video clips. I ain't living but saying I'm about to shit on everyone who ever doubted that win. Came out the trailer. Mama should've wore my ass. I was six when I found a 38 in the grass and I told you. Oh, 
right. Ever since FJ Outlaw has si signed with Mako Music, man, he said he's been making the best music of his life. I'm not gonna lie though. The music he made before was amazing, man. He had so many songs with Forgy Auto Blow, and that's one of my homies right there. You know, me and him chat and stuff, and I love what he's doing. So I already knew about FJ Outlaw, but since he has got on with Mako Music, you know, and has gone under the, the you know the wing of Bravo Gator and all those other guys, it seems like the passion has grown. It seems like this dude has just metamorphosized. Like he got signed to Mako Music and he made a little cocoon, and now he's breaking out of that cocoon and he's just an amazing butterfly. I know butterflies are sissy stuff. It doesn't matter. Y'all understand the analogy I am trying to portray. Let's jump back into some more video clips. I'm sorry for rambling today. This song is going to be fire. This song is going to be fire. This song is going to be an anthem. <laughs> I'll say it now. Mark me down. Mark me down because this song is going to be an anthem. Well, you hear what he's saying and you hear his raspy voice. That's what I like about FJ Outlaw, man. He's like a normal dude. Like, I'm from Florida. I'm from Florida. I know dudes who talk like this. They really do. That's not like an act or something. Like, I know dudes who speak like this. And you might be, you might be like, hey, bro, what the hell? No. <laughs> they're just, they're just, that's them, man. They're authentic. And FJ Outlaw speaks for all of them. And that's what I like about his music, man. And that's what I like about him. We're going to jump into some more clips because I'm excited. Mother, motherfucker, I promise. Just another day up in the office. Bitch, I'm sick of my spit and make a bomb in Relatability is what I love, man, and it's what I like seeing in artists, man. Relatability. If an artist can relate to their fan base, if they can relate to the people that they're talking to, it just makes them more likable, okay? And it also makes it more resonating for the people who are watching it. You see what I'm saying? Like, if we look at somebody on the screen and we're like, man, I dig this guy's music. And man, it looks like I could have a beer with this guy. Or it looks like I could hang out with this guy. Or it looks like this guy is like... Some of the dudes I already hang out with. You see what I'm saying? It's just relatable. Like, it just makes you want to support them even more. It makes you want to like their music even more. You know what I'm saying? And FJ Outlaw definitely has that relatable characteristic. Like, it's just, it's it's phenomenal. You've seen Ghost, you've seen Drake, you know Full Scope is on the scene, man. This is going to be a Full Scope production. I cannot wait for it, man. I cannot wait to drop the Dilly reaction because I enjoy jumping in the Dilly Saloon. Y'all see the Dilly Saloon, man. I can't, I love jumping in the saloon and putting the music on and just vibing out, man. Just enjoying it with y'all, the Dilly fam, Mako Music, all the savages out there. I, I don't know what FJ is going to be calling his fans, the outlaws. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. He might be. Whatever. All y'all, all y'all out there in YouTube world, I enjoy jumping in the Dilly Saloon and doing these reactions with y'all because it's just amazing, man. I love the love that everybody likes to show. All right. <laughs> he got him with that thing. Oh, <laughs> All right, there you have it, folks. There you have it. FJ Outlaw's brand new video dropping. Now, I think it's going to be a trailer park. I think it's going to be a trailer park anthem. I'm just going to say that. I don't know what the song's called, but we've heard the sound bite over and over and over, and already it's kind of like becoming something resonating in my brain. It's definitely a catchy jingle. Like I said, his voice is good. It's just, it just all fits. It all fits. And when things come together and they fit, well, guess what? That's when you get the best product. If y'all like this video, leave me a like, subscribe down bottom, and a comment. Comments are always accepted. I like all comments. Once again, shout out to Sipshine. Shout out to Mako Music. Shout out to Bravo Gator and Savannah Dexter for jumping on the channel and doing the interviews with me. And hopefully in the future, you will see FJ Outlaw too. I don't know, man. We'll see, man. Everything's in the works, man. 2021. This was American Dilly. I am American Dilly. Y'all have a wonderful day. It's America. Oh uh -huh.